So let's just say that I am looking forward to get the last year sales against the current year sales. So the current year sales is $49,000. Against that year, I would like to see the last year sales, which is $30,000. I'm going to go ahead and write a simple measure. In that measure, I'm going to say that I'm trying to calculate total sales and I will wrap this around in the same period last year function. Now you should have the date table connected and I will reference the date column of the calendar or the date table. Close the bracket, press enter. And now if I drag this function to my pivot table, I'm going to see the last year sales against the current year sales. Sometimes you would like to take a look at last to last year sales and compare that with the current year sales. So against $49,000 right here, here I would like to take a look at last to last year sales. I will write the same measure that I just wrote a while ago, but I will double wrap the same period last year in the function once again. So same period last year, same period last year, and then the reference of the date column. Close the bracket, press enter. And if you now drag this formula to your pivot table, what you're going to get is the last to last year sales.